one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Okay, ready. Hey there. Good evening, Maybelline. Good evening, teacher. Hey, how are you feeling today? Roxana and Hi. Nelson. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello, welcome. It's nice to see you again. How how was your day? Do you have a good day today? Say yes. So so uh, not too much. Uh, so so <laughs> so so okay for Nelson for and for Joanna for Roxana. Was it good? Uh, uh, so 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 okay. Maybelline says good, and now we have Carla Maricela. Can you hear me? Hi, teacher. Hello. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's How are a you? lot of energy. I'm great. What about <laughs> you? I like that. It's not so easy to have a lot of energy at this time, right? <laughs> but it's it's nice that you're like that right now. So um, we have Fatima and Nelson. Good evening. Good evening, Norma. Norma and Nelson, can you hear me? Yeah. Hi, teacher. Good Hello, evening. good evening. So, welcome. Uh, we're going to get started. Um, now I see Jocelyn is here. That's nice. Welcome back. And I see Jessica. She's, her audio is connecting. Perfect. Hey, Jessica and Jocelyn. Good evening. How are you feeling today? Good evening, teacher. I feel great. You feel great. Awesome. Okay, so girls and boys too, but especially girls. Today's class is going to be very interesting for you. I have a feeling that it's going to be interesting for you. Because we are going to talk about a topic that is very, very attractive, okay? Um, I would say that it's, it's a very uh, tempting topic. And the topic is shopping. Raise your hand if you like shopping. Raise your hand. Don't feel shy. Don't be shy, okay? You like shopping. I mean, I'm not asking if you go shopping frequently. I'm not asking you right now if um, if you go to a specific place, if you have a lot of money to go shopping to all the, the malls in, in El Salvador. I just want to know if you like shopping because some people say, no, I don't like shopping. I prefer to stay home, maybe delivery, or maybe I can tell my sister, my mother, my wife, my boyfriend to go shopping for me. I don't like to go to stores or stuff like that or places like those, right? So uh, that's the question, okay? Apparently, there are like three people who said that they like shopping. Um, now, I'm going to share the screen with you in a moment. I'm just going to check that every, everybody's listening to me. Catherine and Irene, can you hear me? Yes, I'm here teacher. Okay, 
Nice. So I see Miguel Alexander, uh, Carla, uh, Nelson, Fatima, Jessica, Jesus, and Norma on the camera right now. Now I see Catherine, very good. I'm just missing Roxana and Irene. Uh, okay, there is Roxana, Irene as well. Okay, perfect. So Jose Alberto is here and Ricardo as well. So everybody's coming. That's amazing because we can start right now and I am going to, to take the attendance very, very soon. So as I was telling you, right, uh, I'm going to show you the questions, okay? So that you can start, we can start the class by speaking, right? As soon as you finish speaking, we come back, we take the attendance and we, well, I'm going to introduce the, 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 the class. So that's all that I'm going to tell you right now. We're going to talk about shopping. Um, I am going to create four or five. Let me check how many participants. We have 16 participants. So I'm going to create 18 breakout rooms. So there will be approximately two people in each room. And I'm going to share the screen so you can take a screenshot quickly. Um uh, here we go. So there are three questions, okay? Question number one, uh, Jessica, can you please re read the, the question number one? Do you like shopping? Do you like shopping? Okay, question number two, uh, Carla? What do you like to buy? What do you like to buy? To buy? What do you like to buy? That's correct. Then we're going to listen to, let me see, somebody, somebody. Uh, Jose Alberto, can you please read the question number three? Jose, can you hear me? How often do you go shopping? How often or how often? Do you go shopping? You can say often or often. Mm -hmm. Both are correct. How okay. often do you yeah. go shopping? Mm -hmm. How often do you go shopping? So, mm -hmm. um, let's see. Irene, please ask me the first question. Irene? Yes. Okay, ask me the first yes, question, please. Te la diga. Okay. No, okay, you ask, me ask me, ask oh. me the question, yeah. Pregunte, yeah. as Eugenio Herbe says, right? <laughs> do you like shopping? Yes, I do. I enjoy shopping, okay? Um, question number two, can you ask me the question, Ricardo, please? Yes. Uh, what do you like to buy, teacher? Well, there are different things, but for I example? think that the number one for me uh, is I like to buy technological gadgets. For example, uh, a webcam. I like to buy things for my computer, for my cell phone. Um, let's see. I like to buy Flex. selfie sticks um adapters for my car to listen to music uh, headphones earphones uh, so i think that i like to buy technological gadgets and also uh, gardening gardening things i like to buy things for my garden like um, flower pots or dirt or some tools to plant um those are two things like dollar city style i like i like dollar city because of that they have a lot of things for for the plants for my for my cat for my dog so those those are some things that i like to buy now let's, do you have dogs do you have, have pets? one dog and one cat nice yeah at the beginning it was terrible but now it's terrific <laughs> now it's really good Awesome. Okay, thank you for the questions. Now, uh, I like that. I like interaction, right? If you have doubts, if you have curiosity about any topic, ask the question, okay? This is your class. This is our moment to practice English. 
So forget about Spanish, forget about problems, forget about homework or work. Uh, forget about the cell phone, about the TV, the radio, just focus on practicing and learning English, right? This is the moment of the day to practice more, to learn more. Question number three, I need one volunteer to ask me the question, please. Me teacher. Okay. Uh, how, how, how often do you go shopping? I, I think I go shopping once a month. Uh, once a month. Um, sometimes to the supermarket and sometimes to to get <laughs> little things, uh, maybe to Metro Centro or, or to Dollar City, as I was telling you, right? Because I have things for teaching, like papers, markers. So I find a lot of things there. It's not propaganda, okay? <laughs> now, um, so how often do you go shopping? That is, ¿qué tan a menudo, qué tan frecuentemente van de compras? Okay, here you can use different expressions. How do you say siempre? Always. 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 I always go shopping. How do you say uh, a veces? En ocasiones. Sometimes. Sometimes. sometimes I sometimes go shopping or sometimes I go shopping. Um, how do you say casi nunca? Casi nunca. Hardly never. Almost never. Almost never or okay. almost never. Hardly ever. Or hardly ever. That's correct. Wait a second. What did I select? Uh, I selected the marker. I wanted text. Okay, it's this one. So you say hardly ever or you can say almost never excellent almost never those are two options to say casi nunca um i hardly ever go shopping i almost never go shopping how do you say uh, frequentemente frequently 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 okay frequently or you can say often often I often go shopping. I frequently go shopping. That's correct. Um, one more, one more. How do you say uh, una vez al mes? Once a month. Once upon? Once. Once, once a okay. month. You can say once a month. You can say once a week. Okay, una vez a la semana. You can say once a year, right? Una vez al año, once a year. So once, once is one time, one time. If you want to say two times, two times is twice. Okay. So listen and repeat. Hardly ever. Hardly mm -hmm. ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Very Hardly good. Ever. Almost never. Almost never. Almost, Almost never. 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 Frequently. 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 Often. 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 Hello. What is the question? How do you say uh, una vez al año? Me desparasito. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, that would be I take the parasites treatment once a year. I would say, <laughs> como tomar el tratamiento de los parásitos una vez al, una vez al año. Okay. Uh, vamos, vamos a buscar si hay una palabra específica para decir desparasitar como verbo. Okay. So, um, yeah, once a year or twice a year is recommended. Twice a year. Uh, so let's continue. Listen and repeat. Once a month. Once a month. Once a month. Once. Once a month. Very good. Once a month. Once a week. Once a year. Uh, once a day. Right. Twice a month. Twice. A month. Twice. 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 Very good. Uh, so uh, the rest, 
you can say three times, four times, okay? Uh, you can say three or four or five times, times a month or a year. Si quieren decir tres veces al, al mes o tres veces al año o cuatro o cinco, you say three times or four times. Times is veces, right? In this case. So, uh, very good. That is how often do you go shopping, okay? Um, one more, one more. I'm going to give you one extra word. How do you say rara vez? Rara vez. O raramente. One word that I, what I, what I, that I like is really? seldom. Seldom, seldom, seldom uh, is rara vez. You can say rarely. Yeah, that's another one. Rarely or seldom. I prefer seldom. Really? Seldom. I seldom go shopping. Okay. Uh, so that's what you're going to practice. Right now, I am going to take the attendance because of time. And then we're going to have the conversation with the three questions, right? Irene Beatriz. Present. Irene? Present. Yes, very good. Fatima Abigail. I'm here, teacher. Okay, thank you, Miss Luna. Uh, Miss Mancia. Present. Okay, Mr. Abrego. Present, teacher. Miss Hernandez. I'm here. Okay, very good. Mr. Rivas. Present. There you go. Next one. Uh, Mr. Duarte. Ismael, are you there? No. Okay, Miss Flores. Present. Yes, very good. Present. Mr. Cordova. Mr. Cordova Rodriguez. I'm here, teacher. There you go. Mr. Menendez. I'm here, teacher. Not here. Okay. Mr. Diaz. Diaz Hernandez. Present, teacher. Okay. Miss Reyes de Chavez. Present. Okay. Miss Maldonado. Present. Miss Garcia. Uh, well, she was told me that she was sick, so she was going to be difficult for her to be in the class. Uh, Miss Martinez de Sanchez. Lorena. Okay, let's continue with the next person. That is Mr. Arevalo. Arevalo Linares. Okay, let's continue with the next one. Uh, Maybelline? Present. Present, very good. Next one, Maybelline? That would be Maybelline, right? Hi, Miss. Uh, Miguel Alexander? Present, teacher. Miguel Angel? Present. Okay, uh, Monica? Monica is not here yet. Okay, let's continue with Natalia, Ines. Present. Okay, perfect. That was loud. Nelson, Javier. Okay, Norma. Present. Good. Raquel. Present. Ricardo. Present. Rodolfo Lopez. Not here. Okay, no. Hey, uh, Rosenberg, Guzman. Rosemary. Present teacher. And we have Roxana. Present teacher. And Stephanie. Present. 
Okay, thank you so much. And thank you to the people that already sent me the recording uh, through the through WhatsApp. Teacher, right. no me mencionó. Who, who is talking? Teacher, a mí no me mencionó. Mario, sí lo mencioné. No, no lo escuché. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. Entonces, okay. present. Okay, entonces it's a present. Okay, very good. Let's continue. Teacher, Jorge present también. Jorge present. Vamos a ver si tenemos algún Jorge present por acá. Yes, Jorge Rivas. That's correct. Yes, don't worry. We're good. Jorge. All right, teacher. All Thanks. right. You're welcome. So let's go on. Uh, quickly, we're going to create the breakout rooms so that you can practice the three questions with your partner. Okay, three questions. You like shopping? What do you like to buy? And how often do you like shop? Do you do you go shopping? How often? Right? Ready? Break up rooms in three, two, one. Wait a second, I'm going to move Maybelline to the group number one. Please accept the invitation, please, to start the conversation. Okay, I'm going to assign some of you to other groups. All right. Hey, there you go. Accept the invitation, please. Natalia, you go to the room number four. Raquel, room number seven. Rosemary, number eight. Stephanie, number eight. And Nelson Javier, number eight. There you go. Okay, there you go. How many people we have left? Eight participants, okay. Mario Adolfo, Maybelline, Monica, Ricardo, and Nelson. Accept the invitation to go to the breakout room, please. Uh, okay, wait a second, don't worry. Monica? And Maybelline. Did you receive the invitation, Maybelline? Yes. Okay. Monica, can you hear me? Okay, perfect. So we're ready to go. Hey, Ismael, welcome. I am going to send you to a breakout room. Right now, your classmates are having a conversation about shopping. Okay, okay. teacher, good evening. Good evening, welcome. Thank you. Monica? Can you hear me? Monica, hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, I said the invitation to go to the breakout room, please. Ah, yo le pregunto, es que Mónica no sé si. Hola Mónica, hola Duarte. Creo que tienen problemas. Creo que tienen complicado yeah, I, I think uh, Mónica has some connection problems, yeah. But, ah, okay. but Ismael is there, Ismael is there. Ah, okay. Hi, good evening. Ah, vaya, yo. Significa 
¿Qué tan a menudo va a comprar? Yes, how often do you go ah. shopping? That's correct. A menudo. Um, todo, how do you say fin de semana, weekend? <laughs> Hola. No sé si nos volvemos a hacer las preguntas. Si usted se las hace a, a, a Mario, a Miguel o a mí. Ok, ok. No. Do you like shopping, Miguel? Yes, I like shopping. What do you like to buy? I like to buy electric things. How, how often do you go shopping? I go to shopping hardly ever. Yes, excellent. I hardly ever go shopping. Very good. Congratulations, continue. Hello, did you finish? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to close the rooms right now. The time is up. Teacher. Hello. Tenía una pregunta. ¿Cómo se dice zapatos como deportivos en inglés? Sport shoes. Sport shoes, yes. Or sporting shoes, yeah. Wait a second, I almost forgot that I had to activate the microphone. So we're almost finished. Uh, now, I, I listened to three or four groups uh, talking. So that was really nice to hear you having conversations. Uh, something that you were asking in the conversations, uh, for example, is how to say uh, cada fin de semana. How, how do you say voy de compras cada fin de semana? Any volunteer? who can tell us how to say boy de compras cada fin de semana. I'm going to buy all the weekends. I go shopping all the weekends or I go to buy all the weekends. It is possible all the weekends, todos los fines de semana. Another okay. form, another form. Very good. Thank you, Ricardo. Once a week. Once a week. It is possible. Very but if, you want to say, if you want to say cada, you need to say every. every, 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 that's correct. Thank you, Jorge. Every. every weekend, every weekend. I go shopping every weekend. Very good. I share that in the chat. So we continue with the class. Now I'm going to take the picture. Now that I see a lot of, a lot of people with the cameras on, that's amazing. Wait a second. I'm going to close the chat. One, two, and three. Don't move. Okay, for Facebook. Continue with the next one. Right, okay, I'm gonna take two pictures because we have two rooms. Okay, two screens. One, two, and three. Smile. Every. 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 That's a Okay, let's continue. Now, uh, that's the topic for today, right? So we're going to be talking about shopping. At the beginning, I ask you the question, right? Do you like shopping? And the majority of people say yes, right? Uh, what we don't have sometimes is money to go shopping. Es el pequeño detalle que nos falta a veces nada más para ir de compras. El dinero, pequeño detalle. But, but it is possible to do shopping with no money. Do you know what is the name for the shopping that we do with no money? With big coins? No. <laughs> ah. Hay un tipo de compra que hacemos sin dinero. In English. <laughs> no. Nope. 
It's called window shopping. Window shopping. <laughs> Eso es vitrinear, okay? So window shopping is possible. Um, and you need zero money for that. Window shopping. Hey, let's go shopping. Really? Yes, window shopping. Ah. Uh, so <laughs> that's a oh, That's a me acabo de inventar ese chiste, ya lo voy a guardar en en mi pues en mis uh, It's a clean teacher. Okay. Ajá, para mi, para mi lista. <laughs> okay. Teacher Freddy's jokes. Now, um that's how you say chistes, right? Jokes. Joke. Okay, chistes. Um, now, let's continue. Um, yeah, window shopping is good. It's good for your economy. So let's check. Um, I'm going to share the screen quickly with you so that you can take a look at the website that I am going to show you. Here we go. Share sound. Okay, can you see the the screen right now? Can you see the the, the website? Yes. yes. Okay, perfect. So, uh, right now you are going to listen, okay? Listen and read the conversation. Right now, no practice, only listen. They're perfect for you. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. They're perfect for you. These red ones? I'm not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, these? Hmm, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Well, that necklace isn't bad. Which one? That blue one right there. How much is it? It's $42. That's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. That's a nice present. Right, ladies? Girls, is that a good present in your opinion? A really good. A really yes. good present. Okay. Um, because obviously jewelry in general is 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 a good gift for, for people. Okay, jewelry. That's how you say uh joyeria, right? I'm going to write the vocabulary in the chat. Let me check it out. For some reason, I cannot share the chat. Okay, so if somebody can write down the word, that, that would be good. Okay, I, ah, the chat is open now. Wait a second. Jewelry. If you, want to, if you want to learn new vocabulary, jewelry. 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 That's how you do Yes. Um, okay, so let's practice. Mm -hmm. um, boys and girls, right? So we have a little conversation here. Boys, listen and repeat after me. Oh, look at those earrings, Maria. Oh, look at oh, those listen. earrings, Maria. They're Maria. perfect Maria. for you. Maria. They're perfect for you. Perfect for you. They're perfect for you. That's right. They're. Yeah. Okay, let's continue. Yeah. Girls, girls, listen and repeat. These red ones. These I'm not sure. I'm, I'm not sure. sure. Okay, boys. No, the yellow ones. No, no, the yellow no. ones. The yellow ones. Okay, girls. Oh, these. No. Oh, these. Hmm. Yellow, mm. yellow, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Okay, yellow is really a good color for me. That's right. Okay. Well, that necklace isn't bad. Boys, well, that necklace isn't bad. Well, well that, that necklace well, isn't bad. bad. Girls, which one? 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 Right? Which one? Right? Which one? Boys. Which one? That blue one right there. That blue one. That blue one right there. How much is it? 
How am I? How am I? Okay, girls, it's $42. That's expensive. It's $42. It's expensive. Boys, hey, let me get it for you. Okay. Hey, hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. It's your it's birthday, birthday present. present. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. Very good. So now we are going to try to do the conversation together. Okay. Let's try to do the conversation together, boys and girls. Slowly, right? Relax. Not too fast. Not too slow. Normal. Normal speed. One, two, and three. Oh, look at the uh, sorry, Maria. They're perfect for you. That's correct. The red one is red one. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. No, the yellow one is yellow one. Oh, yellow one. Oh, please. Mm -hmm. Yellow. This is really a good color for me. Well, well, the necklace is bad. Well, that which, 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 which one? Which one? Which one? Blue one, right? 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 How much is it? What? It's for forty dollars. Dollars. Expensive. Expensive. Hey. Hey. Let me get it for you. Birthday present. Birthday Happy birthday. Okay. Very good. It was it was difficult to do it together, but we try. Okay, we try. Now I'm going to choose two volunteers. Uh, Juan Fernando and. Roxana Melissa, please. Then we continue with Jorge and Maybelline. Okay, so Juan Fernando and Roxana, ready, set, activate your microphones, please. Uh, Roxana and Juan Fernando. Okay, one, two, yeah. and three. Teacher, me sale un cuadro en medio. Okay. Ah. Oh, yes. Oh, look at those three rings, Maria. They're perfect for you. Uh, these red ones, I am not sure. No, the yellow ones. Oh, this mm, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Well, that necklace is bad. Which one? That blue one right there. How much is it? It's $42. That's expensive. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday present. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Very good. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you so much, Juan and Roxana. Now we continue with Maybelline and Javier. Ready? Lights, camera, action. I mean, Javier, no, it's Jorge. Sorry, I got confused. Jorge and Maybelline. Ready, set, and go. Oh, look. At those eating Maria. Maria. This red ones, I'm not sure. No, the yellow. No, ones. the yellow ones. The yellow ones. Uh -huh. Oh, this mm, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Okay, Jorge. Will that necklace necklace isn't hard? Bad. But which one? Which one? That blue one right there. There. 
Uh-huh. How yeah. much is it? How much is it? How much is it? It's forty-two dollars. That's expensive. Mm -hmm. Hey. Hey, let me get it for you. Get it for it's you. your birthday present. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday. Okay, correct. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Reactions for Jorge and let me check. Maybelline, please. Now, don't get don't get confused, okay? Uh, if you say beer day, that would be el día de la cerveza, right? Happy birthday. Um, sería como feliz día de la cerveza. No. <laughs> okay. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. It's not Oktoberfest. So, <laughs> okay, let's continue. We continue with the next one. So I'm going to choose Ricardo and Rosemary. Ricardo and Rosemary, please. Ready, set, okay. and go. Oh, look at that. I'm sorry, teacher. Uh, I can't worry, see the imagine. Now? Let me make it bigger for you. Yes. It's better now? Uh, yes. Okay, go ahead. Action. Oh, look at the, oh, look at this earring, Maria. They are perfect for you. Rosemary. This first one, I'm not sure. No, the yellow one. Oh, this, the yellow one. Um, yellow isn't really a good color for me. Well, that's a nickel, isn't bad. Which one? That blue one. That blue one right there. How much is it? It's forty-two dollars. Than expensive. That's expensive. Hey. Hey, let me get it for you. It's your birthday person. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Okay. Thanks a lot. Okay. Volunteers, class for them. A uh, thumbs up. Thumbs up. Right. Now we're going to move on. Okay. This is just to practice, right? Vocabulary about how much, about these, that, those, these. In English, those are called demonstratives. Okay. So listen and read. Listen and read. One, ones. How much is this necklace? How much is this one? How much is that necklace? How much is that one? Which one? The blue one. It's $42. How much are these earrings? How much are these? How much are those earrings? How much are those? Which ones? The yellow ones. They're $18. Prices. $42. $59.95 or $59.95. As you realized, we're talking about demonstrative pronouns. As you know, there are four. This, these, that, those. I... Okay, so this is the explanation, okay? Obviously, you're going to, you can look at the video at any time, right, and practice. But the most important here is that you pay attention to the difference, okay? This, T-H-I-S, and that, T H A T are singular, singular, okay? This and that. These and those are plural, okay? When something is close to you, when something is close to you, you can use, for example, um, I am going to show you, okay, these. These are gloves, these are gloves. These are gloves, it's plural, okay? These are gloves, estos son guantes, these are gloves. If I eliminate one, 
I say this, this is a glove, only one. So difference between singular and plural, this and this, when something is close, cuando tenemos algo cerca de nosotros, este y estos, o estas, o est, dependiendo del, del uh, si es femenino o masculino, right? Estos o estas. If it is far, distant from you, we say that, for example, right now in the, in the imagine that you are uh, with someone in your house. Uh, somebody can tell you, hey, that is your teacher. Alguien que pase por ahí detrás de usted, verdad? Le puede decir, hey, ese es su profesor. That's your teacher. Singular, only one, and is distant. Okay, is distant. For example, um, I am going to pay attention to Stephanie. That is a butterfly, right, Stephanie? On the wall, that's a butterfly. Those are two butterflies. Those, it's plural. Yes? What color, what color are those butterflies, Stephanie? What color are those butterflies? ¿Qué color son esas, esas mariposas, esas dos mariposas? Yellow. Yellow. They are yellow. They are yellow. They is plural. Okay. Now let's go with. I'm going to pay attention to 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 to. Okay, Rosemary. Is that a hammock? Is that a hammock behind you? Es esa una hamaca detrás de, de ti? Yes. It is. Yes, it is. It, right? Singular. Very good. That is a hammock. Esa es una maca. Okay. Um, one more. Norma, are those letters on the wall? Are those letters on the wall? Esas son letras? Yes. Are yes, those? It is. Yes, they. They, they are. They, they are. are. They, they are. are. Yes, they are. Are those letters? Esas son letras. Okay. Esas. Right. Very good. So that is the difference. That is the difference. Now, yes. with the exercise, with the exercise, you will practice more. Right. So the exercise is in the book, as you already know. Uh, however, I am going to show you. Wait a second. Okay, so in the manual, I'm going to share something else right now with you. Let me show you here. So when you check the manual that you have in, uh, at home, in your computer, in your cell phone, right? And you pay attention to this part. Okay, demonstratives. So we have exercise A that is about using these, that, those, and this. Um, and also we use one and ones. Uh, if you have an idea, right? If you don't have an idea about one and ones, utilizamos, los utilizamos one and ones cuando queremos omitir de qué estamos hablando. Eh, o no sabemos de qué estamos hablando, de qué específicamente están hablando. For example, if you see the picture, uh, hey, do you like the backpack? Do you like the backpack? Y ustedes están como que, ¿en cuál mochila? Hay varias, right? ¿Cómo preguntarían? ¿Cómo preguntarían cuál? Sin decir mochila. Which one? Which one? Which one? Very good. Nice. Excuse me, teacher. Hello? Which one, Excuse teacher? Me. Uh huh. What happened? Tell me. Question. If you ah. No, la letra no se preocupen. Ahorita no tienen que leerla. Solo estamos viendo las imágenes. Okay. Eh, yeah. Don't worry. Be happy. Now, eh, in this case, we are. You ask me which one, right? Now, eh. Picture number one, you see two women, right? 
I ask you, I tell you, right? Uh, hey, do you like the shirts? Or do you like the jeans? Do you like it? How do you ask cuáles? In plural. Which ones? Which, Which ones? ones? Which ones? Very good. Uh, if I ask you, for example, hey, did you finish the homework? You said, tan como que, ¿cuál tarea? Which one, teacher? Which one, right? ¿Cuál? ¿Cuál? Para no repetir, ¿cuál tarea? Okay. So you say which one or which ones? Qual or quales? That is the use of one or ones. Uh, for example, if you want to say, me gusta la, uh, la que tiene un dibujo. Me, hablando de la mochila, me gusta la que tiene un dibujo. I like the one, I like the one that has a drawing. Me gusta la que tiene un dibujo. Okay, the one that has a drawing. Uh, the jeans, which jeans do you like? I like the ones uh, that are $59. I like the ones that are $59. Me gustan los jeans que valen $59, right? Uh, no digo jeans, pero se, me refiero a eso, porque está dentro de la conversación, del contexto. Okay, so um, you are going to... Complete these exercises, right? You have this manual. El, el manual lo tienen uh, para su uso, como ustedes quieran, ¿verdad? Eh, para practicar. Okay? So, right yes. now, right now, we're going to continue. Do you have questions about this, that, those, about prices? If you say $42, $95. Any questions about prices, demonstratives? ¿Alguna pregunta sobre los demostrativos o los precios? ¿Cómo utilizar one or ones? Yes, no. No questions? No. Okay. Let's imagine. Let's imagine something. Uh, you are going to use expressions. Listen and repeat. That's cheap. That's cheap. That's cheap. That's cheap. That's, a, That's cheap. That's cheap. Eso es barato o está barato, right? That's cheap. That's reasonable. That's reasonable. That's reasonable. Reasonable. That's reasonable. Razonable, right? Razonable, okay? That's okay. Reasonable. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's not bad. Okay. That's not bad. 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 And the last one, that's expensive. That's expensive. That's expensive. That's expensive. Expensive. That's expensive. Is the opposite of cheap. That's expensive. That's expensive. It's the opposite. Okay, expensive is the opposite of cheap, right? Not expensive. Cheap, barato. Expensive, caro. Caro. Okay. okay, I am going. I am going to say the prices. All right. I am going to say the price, and you tell me the expression. Okay. So, ask me the question. How much is this? Is the red cell phone? Ask me the question, please. How much is the red cell phone? How much is the red cell phone? Um, it's one thousand dollars. It's one thousand dollars. Vale mil dollars. What is the expression? What is expensive. That's expensive. Okay, it's a Nokia, right? So, okay, continue. Ask me the question about the black sunglasses. How much are how much are these these glasses sunglasses 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 uh, they're ten dollars ten dollars 
expression? $10. That's cheap. That's cheap? Yeah, it's cheap, right? Okay, very good. Uh, cash or that's credit okay. card? Okay, that's, that's okay. okay. That's okay. Not bad. That's not bad. Okay, next one. Uh, the pink, the pink sunglasses are $25. The pink sunglasses are $25. What is your expression about, about that price? $25 for the pink sunglasses. Somebody who can express that? That's cheap. Sunglasses. That's reasonable. That's not bad. Not bad. Reasonable, right? Reasonable. Yep. Good. Now let's continue. Uh, so we're going to um, skip this part, right? So please complete the exercise letter A to practice these, that, those. Uh, I am going to just take the attendance quickly, okay, before the time it's over, antes de que el tiempo se acabe. Um, vamos a tomar la asistencia rapidito. And the pictures. One, two, three. Okay, let's see. Uh, The next one is the picture number one. One, two, and three. Okay. So tomorrow, in tomorrow's class, this is what you're going to do. Okay. Um, this is what you're going to do. Eso es lo que van a hacer en la clase de mañana para que ya vayan preparándose. Uh, you are going to play. You're going to do a role play. Okay. Role play es un juego de roles. So you are going to be Student A or student B? Student A, you are a clerk, answer the customer's questions. Eres un uh, encargado de tienda, responde las preguntas del cliente. Student B, you are a customer, ask about the price of each item. Say if you want to buy it. Student B, student B va a ser un cliente, pregunta sobre el precio de cada artículo. Okay? Y di si quieres comprarlo. For example, can I help you? Hi, can I help you? Yes, I like these sunglasses. How much are they? Which ones? Um, y ahí va, va a crear su, su role, okay, su conversación inventada. Okay, le voy a dar el tiempo para que puedan inventarla en parejas. Y luego al regresar a la sesión, después de que ya la inventaron y la preguntaron, van a hacer la, la conversación bien creativa de cada, de cada pareja en la sesión, para que todos los demás los escuchemos, ok um, so okay. Para, para los objetos para los objetos pueden utilizar los que se sugieran aquí o, o objetos que ustedes tal vez tengan en su casa Listo. en este momento ok uh, let me check always check the microphone Always check that the microphone is off, ¿ok? Siempre revisen que el micrófono esté apagado cuando no estén eh, participando. Ok, so eh, I am going to call out the names. Let me see. The first name that I see here is Irene. Are you there? Present. Yes. Ok, Fátima. I'm here. Jessica. Present. Jesús. Here. Joana. Joana. Araceli. Yes, no. Sorry, teacher. Okay. <laughs> I'm here. There you go. Jorge. George. Present, teacher. Okay. Ismael. I'm here, teacher. Okay, there you go. Jocelyn. <laughs> I'm here. Gasoline, Flores, Jose Alberto. Okay, very good. Juan Fernando. Present. Then we have Carla Maricela. Carla Maricela. I'm here, teacher. Okay. 
Thank you. Teacher. Next one. Uh, Catherine. Present. Kenya is not here. Uh, Lorena. Lorena. Emilet. Mario. Mario Adolfo. Present teacher. Okay, there you are. Mario Maybelline. Present. Miguel Alexander. Present teacher. Miguel Angel. Miguel Angel. Monica. Present. Okay, thank you, Miguel. Monica. Present teacher. Okay, so Monica is not here. Natalia. Present. Thank you. Uh, then we have Nelson. Present. Norma. Present. Raquel. Present. Ricardo. Present teacher. Uh, well, Rodolfo is not here. Then we have Rosenberg who's not here. Rosemary. Janet. Present teacher. Okay, Roxana. Present teacher. And Stephanie. Present. Thank you so much, guys. Um, so do you have any questions or comments before we finish today's class? Yes, no, everything is clear. Clear. Did you learn something new today? All clear, teacher. All clear, okay. Did you learn something new today? Yes, no. Aprendieron algo nuevo hoy? Expressions, topics. Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, teacher. So, thank yes, you teacher. so much. Have a good night. Bon appetit if you're going to have dinner. We don't know, right? Thank you so much for the reactions. I love that you learned something new. And I will see you tomorrow, okay? Take care of yourself. See you tomorrow, see you teacher. Tomorrow, see you. teacher. Good night. Tomorrow, Peter. Good night. 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 Good night.